This is Neil Walters. I stayed in the Congress Hotel in Miami, South Beach, a couple of months ago, and I wanted to tell you about my stay there. First, uh, there's a couple pictures of the lobby. I think this is the older one, and then now it looks more like this, except the chairs weren't in there. And one thing nice about the lobby was they actually gave you a glass of sangria to uh, greet you and to take to your room with you. The hotel consists of about three or four buildings, so you really will need the bellboy to take you to your room. Mine is up there where that red arrow is in what could be the third or fourth building. This is a photo I found that perhaps shows all the buildings that they actually own. So right past this restaurant and street, they gave you a code to go through this gate, and then you have this nice private alley here. And part of that alley, you were actually behind a restaurant. But anyway, you go in there, and there's another little door with the key they give you, and then you go up an elevator, and that's how I got to my room. One thing I really liked about the hotel was the nice kitchenette with a microwave, a stove top with two burners, refrigerator, etc. The sofa and the desk maybe showed a little wear and weren't necessarily that comfortable, but I think the theory is you're not going to be spending a lot of time in your room when you're in Miami Beach. The, uh, there was a television in the living room and also in the bedroom. Here's a shot of the bedroom from the internet. And the TV screens are rather small. I'm not sure they had a very large cable selection, but again, you're probably not going to be watching a lot of TV in your room. I was there for a conference, so I wasn't in my room hardly at all, because uh, we had a yacht ride one night and went to the Sky Lounge one night. And of course, the bathroom was, uh, I think, rather well designed, had a shower rain head, a rain head shower top, and a very nice uh, appearance. This was my view from my room, looking to the other hotel, and I could actually see the ocean from my room kind of nice. You can see the sunrise and I went to the beach one morning just right across the street. One other minor comment was that the bed was a little bit low and then there were two low nightstands on the side which was not a problem for me. The other potential issue is you're right on Miami Beach so there are a lot of nightclubs there and I think I could hear music going till probably 2, 2.30 in the morning on a Sunday night. I was there Sunday through Tuesday so if you don't like that part, if you're not out there to party you might not want this hotel on a weekend. This is an example of the restaurant that is right outside the gate that was beside the hotel. This is a view outside the hotel. The streets felt very safe. I saw children around and I also saw a lot of police. So. I didn't see any problem, didn't feel scared at all. And here are just some examples of the sidewalk cafes and the nightlife within a few blocks of the Congress Hotel. This is to show you how nice and quiet it is the next morning on the beach. So overall, I really did enjoy this hotel. It was close to where I was uh, attending my seminar, and uh, the rooms were nice. They had a kitchenette, the nice bathroom. The price was reasonable compared to other hotels I looked at, so I would stay there again. Okay, I've shared a lot with you about the hotel. I'd like to share with you just a little while I was there. I went to the Temple House for a business meeting. We had 200 people there for a private mastermind with business leaders from around the world teaching us the latest techniques and marketing on the internet, including YouTube, Facebook, and many other methods. And we are people that are positive, motivated, and making money, and I'd like to share that with you. There will be some links here at the end, and as I close out, I'm going to play an amazing guitarist I heard on the street doing his rendition of Hotel California.
just took a yacht ride last night with our mastermind team members around the Miami Beach area. We're headed back home to implement all the things we've learned in the last couple of days. So check out the link below.